everyone this is Kesh thank you for tuning into my channel today's look will be this um, neutral eye and it's a part of my neutral eye series that I promised ages ago I'm just getting to it and it will be running um, with another series that I'll be doing which is a color series so this is one of the looks from my neutral series I don't know what I'll be calling it yet but by now you should already see the title um, don't forget to comment below like this video share on any other social media site that you may use also if you haven't already subscribe to my channel follow me on Instagram and like my Facebook page thank you for watching I'm starting off by priming my lids and I'm going to prime the entire area um, close to my even up close to my eyebrows um, just so my shadow stays on longer and so that it does not crease and I'm just using my fingers to blend all of that out next I'm taking my blending brush and I am using that Prisma face powder the one that I've been using for my transition color and it's a reddish brown so that's what I'll be using for my transition color again and as I said before I'm just using my elf blending brush to just blend it all out next I'm taking a dark brown from my NYX beauty box and I'm dragging that in my crease and just a little bit above my crease and I am placing um, the I'm using a pencil brush also I'm going to put a bit of product on it next I'm using my blending brush to just blend out the dark brown that I place in my crease so that it does not look too harsh I'm also going to use my NYX eyeshadow base the white one and I'm putting that on my mobile lid before I add the colors that I'll be placing on my lids because I want the colors to be brighter than the they want them to show bright on the lid I'm just using some of the same brown that I used in the crease of my eyes to just drag um, to the outer V to create a gradient effect when I add the other shadows and I'm ensuring that I place it just at the end of the outer V next I'm taking an eyeshadow blush and I'm using that in um, rose gold color from my NYX beauty box and I'm placing that in the center and I'm only going to leave a small portion of my eyelids um, to put a different color on so I'm just packing that on I'm using that small eyeshadow brush and I'm going for a light shade of gold and I'm placing that in the inner third of my eyelids and I'm ensuring that it overlaps with the rose gold next I'm just using my blending brush just blend everything out from that MAC palette I am using the gold I will try to see if I can find the name of that color to put in the description box below but it's a gold and it's very very pigmented very bright so I'm putting that in my inner tear duct and I'm dragging it to the um, inner third of my lower lash line and for the rest of my lash line I'm just going to use the same rose gold that I used on my lids and I'm just smudging it out a little bit next I am lining my waterline with a black eyeliner pencil and I am going to be adding the same gold that I added to the inner third of my um, lid as my highlight my brow bone highlight so that's what it looks like so far off camera I did a winged liner now I'm going to take that Ioni Cosmetics liquid liner and from my lower lash line I'm just going to drag another line because I'm creating a double winged effect and I'm also going to put that on the inner third of my eyes so that it does not look like the wing is is not attached to anything so that's what I'm doing right there and when I looked at it it looked like it needed to be extended so that's what I was doing so that's what it looks like and you already know my favorite mascara my favorite mascara is the Maybelline great lash mascara because of the brush and it gets 
um, my lower lashes very well so I'm just placing that on my um, lashes because I will not be using any fake lashes in this video and I'm doing both the upper and the lower lashes. Next I'm taking my favorite plum lip liner and I am lining my lips. So that's what I'm doing both top and bottom. Just lining my lips with my favorite plum lip liner. And I find that I wear this lip liner with almost every lipstick. I don't know why I love this lip liner so much. I think it goes well with my skin tone. Alright, the color that I'll be wearing on my lips is by Estee Lauder. It's a peach gloss, so it's like a liquid lipstick. Um, so it has both color and it remain it has a sheen. So it's a peach lip gloss, and that's what I'm placing on my lips. So that's the final look. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Stay tuned for more tutorials in my Neutral Eye series. And don't forget to comment, share, like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram. Thank you for watching.